In the small, sleepy town of Willowbrook, on the edge of a forest that hummed with mystery, there lived a curious boy named Milo. Milo was an adventurer at heart, always seeking the secrets hidden in the nooks and crannies of the world around him. One sunny afternoon, Milo decided to explore the forest that bordered his backyard, a place he had always been told was ordinary. But Milo would soon discover that this forest was anything but ordinary. As Milo stepped into the cool shade of the trees, he felt a strange sensation, as if the forest itself was alive and watching him. He wandered deeper, drawn by a force he couldn't explain, until he came upon a clearing where the sun dappled the ground through the leaves. It was there that Milo heard it for the first time, a gentle whisper, like leaves rustling in the wind, but with words. Hello, young explorer, murmured a tall oak tree, its leaves shimmering in the sunlight. Startled, Milo looked around, wondering if he was imagining things. But then another voice chimed in, this time from a willow tree, its branches swaying softly. Welcome to the Whispering Woods, where the trees speak, and nature shares its secrets. Milo couldn't believe his ears. Talking trees. He had stumbled upon a magical forest where the trees could speak. Each tree introduced itself, sharing stories of the forest and the creatures that called it home. Milo listened in awe, his heart swelling with wonder. The oak tree, wise and strong, taught Milo about resilience and the importance of standing tall in the face of challenges. Like my roots that grip the earth, the oak said, you too must find strength in your foundations and family and friends. The willow tree, with its graceful branches, spoke of flexibility and the ability to adapt. Even in the strongest wind, I sway but do not break. Remember, Milo, sometimes bending is better than breaking. As Milo ventured further, he met more trees, each with its own lesson. The maple tree taught him about generosity as it shared its sap for syrup. The birch, with its peeling bark, spoke of renewal and the beauty of letting go of the old to make way for the new. But it was the ancient cedar that shared the most important lesson of all. All of us here, every tree and creature, are connected, the cedar whispered, its voice deep and echoing. We share the air, the water, and the earth. Look after us, and we will look after you. This is the balance of nature. Moved by the cedar's words, Milo promised to protect the forest and all its inhabitants, to be a guardian of nature. He spent the day listening and learning, and as the sun began to set, he knew it was time to return home, his heart and mind filled with the stories and wisdom of the trees. Back in Willowbrook, Milo shared his incredible adventure with anyone who would listen. He spoke of the talking trees and the lessons they had taught him, inspiring others to appreciate and care for the nature around them. Milo returned to the forest often, each visit a new adventure, a new story to be told. And so, the Whispering Woods became a place of magic and learning, a reminder that if we listen closely, nature has much to teach us. Milo, now the forest's greatest advocate, knew that as long as the trees whispered, he would be there to listen and to share their wisdom with the world.